uh, from uh, D.C. as well. Ooh. Got a fine uh, anchor team from NBC4 in D.C., and they can't stop laughing at a video of a model falling down. Oh, I saw this. This is hilarious. I saw this on uh, YouTube. Yeah, the video is really funny, but the audio is just as good. So yeah. they're showing a video clip of a model falling down, and the anchors just <laughs> can't get enough. She of falls it. twice. Yeah. And the second time she falls, the reason they're laughing so hard, and I started cracking up, she, her legs are wobbling like a newborn foal, and she's trying to keep herself up, and then she just loses it and falls on the floor again. So they just kept, keep playing it over and over again and just laughing their asses off. This is Fashion Week over in Paris. The latest fashions are on the runway for next spring. But there was a problem out there today. One of the British designers' shows had the difficulty. A model fell down twice. That's her going down once. The young woman wearing that pink skirt and the orange platform shoes never quite recovered after that. There she goes. <laughs> That had to hurt. That was uncool. That's embarrassing. This is at least the second time. <laughs> well, you all are just really tickled by that, aren't you? You try walking in those shoes. Hey, first of all, baby, I got enough meat on me that it's all right. George, <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Let's, Come we, on, we want to apologize. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> that was great about that. He's that got that funny. Sm that smoking oh, laugh. Oh, yeah. The smoker's laugh, man. That's, that's great. And he was ready to say something like, yeah, we want to apologize. And the guy goes, wait, wait, hold it, watch, because it was coming again. Yeah, yeah. They kept playing it over, over and, and over. over. How many times did she fall? Like twice. She fell twice, but they kept playing the clip over and over again. Her legs give out on her and start shaking, and th these guys just lose their minds laughing. <laughs> Where's the other one? I only show her falling once. Oh, they keep yeah, they keep going back to it. Yeah. Yeah. She, Watch. She falls. <laughs> Look at her legs. <laughs> that is great. Oh, she said wobble. She, can't she stand wobbled. On those like, she, she almost made it. She wobbled like three times. They just they keep playing oh, it, too. Oh, and they go, oh, 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 she took quite a tumble. Just... Dummy. Have a sandwich, you that stupid ass. Damn funny. <laughs> hey guys, it's losing it. That's the most respect I've had for the news. Oh, absolutely. Would that be funny if it was a drunk driving story? <laughs> <laughs> it ended in tragedy. <laughs> you know, that probably would be really good to take that clip of them laughing that hard and put some horribly tragic news behind it. Can we get on that? Yeah, can we try and do that? that? We'll let our guys get to it. Yeah, well, our, we, got, uh, we do we have, have some very talented um, people that use various video editing equipment. Hey, that's, that's a great idea. Trying to see what we got in front of us. Take them laughing and then just uh, put some horrific... Man charged with pimping disabled women. He said he didn't pimp them. The victims uh, told police... <laughs> 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 Did they? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You have hair like Mo Howard from the Three Stooges. <laughs> Your tongue is fat. <laughs> big hands. Uh, we're going to big hands in a while. Can, can you uh, put up some missing feedback? Uh, I don't want to forget about big hands. <laughs> you fat tongue. All right, we'll see what happens. Talk. Now we got to play the story. God hates you. Now we got to play the story. Now I wish I had the smokers laugh for this. Time. Rocks aren't candy. <laughs> <laughs> Can you? Uh, your family crops you out of photographs. <laughs> yeah. Your mother drank during pregnancy. <laughs> That's rough. <laughs> Um, by the way, can I interrupt everybody, please? When a hanger would have solved a lot of problems. <laughs> yes. Uh, wait. Oh. You'll have to be cared for until you're 50. <laughs> then you'll just die. Goodness gracious! <laughs> Goodness gracious! Everyone has heard this by now. <laughs> Those are two guys, legendary newsmen from uh, the Washington area. We'll be in Washington, obviously, later this week. We got the virus tour on Saturday, broadcasting live from Washington Friday. Details to come. But um, 
Why don't we play the original Why They Were Laughing? Basically, they were watching a video of a model falling in Paris or something, and these two just lost their minds. This is Fashion Week over in Paris. The latest fashions are on the runway for next spring. But there was a problem out there today. One of the British designers' shows had the difficulty. A model fell down twice. That's her going down once. The young woman wearing that pink skirt and the orange platform shoes never quite recovered after that. There she goes. <laughs> that had to hurt. That was uncool. That's embarrassing. This is at least the second time. <laughs> well, you all are just really tickled by that, aren't you? You try walking in those shoes. Hey, first of all, baby, I got enough meat on me that it's all right. <laughs> He wanted to talk over the second yeah, fall. Yeah, the fall is coming up again. Hold yeah. on, hold on. Yeah, he's like, don't write this for Let's me. Let's say this. I don't watch this 20 <laughs> times. I think this one is just as cute a story. Oh, oh this adorable. One, this is cute. Sometimes things like a model falling and stuff it gets you laughing, and yeah. this uh, is no exception. Yeah. yeah, you know, the human interest stories will get uh, some of these news anchormen. Uh, just losing their minds. Well, yeah. we got a brand new one today. Oh, good. Coming out of uh, Nebraska. This is Jay Warren of WSLS Nebraska. Listen Sometimes to this it's one. It's just too, too much fun going on in that newsroom. A fire crash leaves three people dead. Police in Nebraska say a rental truck carrying two people lost control, crossed the median, and collided head on with a semi truck. Both trucks burst into flames, and witnesses say there were several explosions. The two. <laughs> Excuse me. The two people in the room, <laughs> the two people in the rental truck and the driver of the semi. This is a sad story. Excuse me, were killed. Crews say they had fires contained in about ten minutes. Why was this guy laughing? Do I, we know the. It might have been yet? because it, I, I'm just speculating. It might have just been because it was such a complete disaster. It's like an action movie. Come on. They, they collide, burst into flames, three explosions. I don't know. Why wouldn't he pass this to someone? Like, when you realize you, you, like, you know where you have to go with this, why wouldn't you go, excuse me, just improv yeah, and get... Just kind of go like, <clears throat> excuse me, I... <clears throat> Can uh, can Bill take the story? I oh, have I mean, something in my throat. You can't finish that. A big story. laugh. But if you get that a laughing attack, there's nothing that could stop it. You just get really silly. Do we have an answer why the guy was laughing? Wouldn't it be funny if his, his response was, I, I read what happened and it just struck me as funny? <laughs> <laughs> Doesn't even try. Right. Yeah, it just, it just it, really it, struck me as funny. He's probably an award-winning journalist. Uh, he's been at this place since 98. Uh, and uh, he's like an anchor. I mean, he's not just like, you know, he's yeah. like a real news anchor. <laughs> and, uh, oof. Maybe they yeah. didn't uh, fire him? I don't know. It doesn't really say People here. People are very sensitive these days. Yeah, that, that's a, well, that, to me, that's if you're a newscaster and you're laughing through a head-on collision story, you should be fired. Well, the job might not be for you. But yeah, that's yeah. Your, your job is to do those stories and not laugh. Right. And act concerned because they don't they don't care. He's a shock news guy. Yeah, shock Maybe news. It's a new trend. Maybe just to try to get the ratings up or something. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'd love to know why he was. Yeah, we'll try to find out. If anyone knows, please give us a call. Okay. Didn't he apologize later in that newscast or something? Ah, oh, they always do. I mean, do we have any information? I mean, they have to. They have to do a follow up. Well, this is just hitting the old uh, the wire. The old wire. So we'll, hopefully, we'll have more info on that. Uh, I want to hear that again, though. You bet I do. Absolutely. Listen where he goes. Um, he he said something and then pauses. He realizes he can't, can't stop his laugh. And then realizes too. Oh no! There's he, no way I'm getting through he this. He couldn't shake it. A fire crash leaves three people dead. Police in Nebraska say a rental truck carrying two people lost control, crossed the median and collided head on with a semi truck. Both trucks burst into flames and witnesses say there were several explosions. The two. <laughs> Excuse me. The two people in the room. <laughs> the two people in the room truck and tried to just too much. This is a sad story. Excuse me. We're killed. Crew said they had fires contained in about 10 minutes. <laughs> Oh. oh, my 
my God, that's awful. But you have to be panicking internally when that's happening. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Because you understand, you're on. You're a news guy on camera, live. Laughing at a multiple death story. A head-on collision story. Yeah. <laughs> Flaming wreckage story. You couldn't pick a worse story a worse to laugh story at. Unless children were involved. It, it literally, you, the, nothing worse <laughs> than a head-on fiery wreck collision story <laughs> to laugh at if you're a news guy. All right. We got to take a quick break. Uh, get over there, E-Rock. I got a point to you. Our phone number, 877-212-ONA. You're listening to Opie and Anthony. All right. Well, that sucked. To hear the Opie and Anthony show five days a week, live on satellite radio, online on your phone or tablet, or even on demand, go to SiriusXM.com. Also, interact with the Opie and Anthony show on Twitter, at Opie Radio, at Anthony Cumia, and at Jim Norton.